We have one common goal, basically, which is get better at basketball. Growing up in the Eastern European country of Georgia, Georgie Kaguishvili fell in love with basketball thanks to the movie Space Jam, co-starring Bugs Bunny and some guy named Jordan. Ready? Yeah! When I saw Michael Jordan, um, I became a fan right away, and I just wanted to uh, play like him or, you know, be like him. But Georgie's country had just fought a civil war. There were no functional basketball courts. So Georgie and some friends cut out the seat of a chair to make a hoop. And he had talent. He was recruited to play in America at one of the top prep schools. So at 17 years old, he moved to the U.S. by himself without knowing any English. The fact that I played basketball, uh, that helped me a lot because, you know, we, we spoke the same language. That language was basketball. His teammates included future NBA players Ennis Cantor and Anthony Bennett. Georgie got offers from Division I colleges, but because he didn't speak English, his SAT scores weren't good enough. So he went to a small Division II school, studied agriculture, and planned to go back home to work the land. Before he left, he wanted to see New York. When I got to New York, my friend called me from the Georgian consulate, and he was like, hey, we have this internship opportunity if you want to stay. Georgie got the internship. To pay the bills, he started hosting training sessions at a park in Brighton Beach, Brooklyn, then in a gym at a Greek Orthodox church. One, two, three, two, one. Now he's hosting a clinic for more than 120 kids at the Italian Center in Bensonhurst. He's a fun guy. Whenever I play basketball, it feels good to me. Maybe one day I can, I can stand up and say that it was the American dream, but right now I'm working towards it. Which is why Coach Gio says he wants to make sure that his students are learning on the court and in the classroom. Before they can perform in practice, they have to perform in school. We have this policy, if you don't have good grades and above 90%, you won't practice with us. Veronica Chodkiewicz's daughter plays here with kids from all over. And I think it's just fantastic. So they, they learn how to work together with these kids and how to respect each other. It speaks true character and it brings in a loving environment, a caring environment that no matter what you look like, no matter where you're from, you'll always be loved and respected for who you are. Reporting from Bensonhurst, Joe Masiri, Pix11 News.